dreams are messages from the deep. The sound design is already crazy for the sand rolling over the hills. They ravage our lands in front of our eyes. By controlling spice production, they became obscenely rich. Man, I just know this color grading is going to make me want water. Bro is just in the sand waiting? We're two minutes into the movie and I already understand why it won or why why it's praised for, for the graphics and for the VFX. This shit kind of like Star Wars, but not really so far. Timothy Shamalatin? Shamahu? Shamala? Father wants your full dress before the Empress Herald arrives. Use the voice. Mom, I just woke up. Give me the water. The glass can't hear you. Come on, me. Is he seducing his mom? What the fuck's going on? Give me the water. Can he like throw his voice? The Fremen shared a deep desert with the giant sandworms. Long exposure to spice has given the tribe their characteristic blue eyes. Fremen attacks make spice harvesting extremely hazardous. Without spice, interstellar travel is impossible, making it by far the most valuable substance in the universe. So spice is basically gold, right? and everybody wants a cut for their own individual reasons. This is like the rape and pillage of America, basically. These, it belongs to these people, but we need it for our space travel, so let's go get it. How much will it cost them traveling all this way for this formality? Three guild navigators, a total of 1.46 million 62 salaries round trip. I thought he rolled his eyes. <laughs> I stand before you as herald of the change. I'm kind of fucking freaked out by their costume design, bro. It's just making me mad uncomfortable. They look like flies right here. And then the chick looks like the emperor, the one that's in all black. House Atreides shall immediately take control of Arrakis. Do you accept? Fuck no. I don't know what any of that meant. <laughs> Is it just me or do y'all guys get lost whenever we have like movies about fantasy? Like how am I supposed to keep all these fucking names and like governing bodies in order? That's how I felt about Game of Thrones. I'm like, wait, 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 who are we talking about? What's this person's name? And I want a dope ass seal on a ring. That'd be so live. Bro pulled at least 30 G's right there. Ain't no way that person's alive. <laughs> See how fast that was coming in and the change of direction? Oh boy. Hey. <laughs> oh shit, that's what's his name? I've been having dreams about Arrakis and the Fremen. Is she actually in the movie or no? I saw you lying dead, fallen in battle. Felt like if I had been there, you'd be alive. They'll travel in a few weeks to Arrakis like the rest of us. I've been training my whole life. What is the point if I'm not allowed to you face an actual why, risk? Paul, you're the future of House Atreides. This is the classic story of the young buck that wants to do too much. The great houses look to us for leadership. And this threatens the Emperor. Mining spice, keeping the Fremen in their place. By making an alliance with the Fremen. On Arrakis, we need to cultivate desert power. I want you sitting in on my council. Learn what I do. What if I'm not dead? I told my father I didn't want this either. A great man doesn't seek to lead. Yup. He's called to it. Bars. And he answers. And if your answer is no, you'll still be the only thing I ever needed you to be. My son. I'm too good at this, bro. <laughs> Subscribe to Patreon just because I'm good at this. Don't stand with your back to the door. Hey, if you're a dude, do you automatically never sit back to the door in a restaurant? Like, I do that. I, I never sit back to the door, and I always know where all the exits are at all times. Like Jason Bourne type shit. I don't know all the license plates, but still. Ah, the slow blade penetrates the shield. Bro, this shit is so crazy. And it's not even the graphics. The graphics are cool, right? But it's the sound design that's... Like, you ever just hear a sound and you're like, where the fuck did they come up with that? Because all sounds are real, like come from real life, and they just distort them to sound certain ways. They layer, they stack. Well, who can't, who's the sound engineer on this? It sounds like static, but with a little bit of bass and electronic in there. Bro, it's so hard. Look at that shit. I have you. I'm gonna look down, my lord. You're to join me in death. Fire, bro. <laughs> just a cocky little kid. Youth is wasted on the young. Bet two 
more names I have to remember. The last of our ships have left Arrakis. Very good. Bro's just in the sauna? <laughs> Uncle, how can we let this happen? How can the Emperor take everything we built and give it to that Duke? I don't know why I'm like low key scared right now. This whole world and this whole universe that we're watching right here has me feeling unsettled. Is it the darkness? Is it the the grand scale of everything making me feel small? Look at this, bro. Look at this fucking cinematography right here. Like it's gas. Like this might be one of the best cinematic movies that I've seen this year. It makes me feel unsettled. Like I said, it, it, it reminds me of like obviously a much grander and much ex more expensive scaled version of 21 Pilots' whole world of Dima that they built with their last three albums. Get dressed and come with me. Little Alexa floating around. I'm sorry. I didn't understand you. Your mother asked me to check your vitals. You broke and just see the vitals. What's happening? <laughs> like, what the fuck are you doing? Defiance in the eyes. Like his father. You dismissed my mother in her own house. Come here. Kneel. That's the voice that he was practicing earlier, but much better, clearly. She says, shut the fuck up and get over here. Put your right hand in the box. I hold at your neck the gom java. Instant death. The test is simple. Remove your hand from the box. And you die. It's in the box. Pain. Your mother stands behind that door. She no knows what the fuck's up. Her. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? Silence. Oh yeah, yeah, we got past the pain tolerance, bitch. Now what? I'm built different. I've walked across a thousand suns. That'd be some crazy ass line in this movie. Some dumb shit they would say. Bro throwing up the east side. Enough. Bitch, I could go all day. What's up? What you trying to be about? If you had been unable to control your impulses like an animal, <laughs> it could not let you live. You inherit too much power. I respect it. I would have had to kill you, son, because you ain't got no, no one man should have all that power type beat. It's kind of fire and low key. You knew what it was. I would have had to kill you. You just, you can't just go run in the muck. You can't go run in the muck with the power you have. Jessica. I didn't kill your son after all. You've been training him in the way. Can you show me the Tell way? Me about these dreams. Oh, girl. On Arrakis. Have you dreamt of her before? Many times. He wields our power. He had to be tested to the limits. Hey, yo, the reflection on the ground is so fucking insane, bro. It's not even the it's not even the floating orb. That's cool. But the reflection and the refraction through the light on the ground and the water on the ground. You were told to bear only daughters, but you and your pride thought you could produce the Kwisatz Haderach. Was I wrong? If he is the one, he has a long way to go. So in this world, we get to just choose what gender we want to have? We don't even wait for the kid to choose the gender? What does it mean? That I could be the one? Powerful enough to bridge space and time. Ooh, that's you, son. Future. That's you, my boy. It's a lot of weight on those shoulders. Son, really, he's here. Man, the water simulation is so insane right here. My computer would have blown the fuck up already. This thing gives me the fucking creeps, bro. Why did we shape it like this? It's tr it's giving me that f the trypophobia so badly. You know what it reminds me of? And this is probably going to kill the dramatic mood. That one SpongeBob episode where they go into the worm. <laughs> when the worm's just chilling there and they walk in. Bro, looks like a leech. That's really what is making me feel weird about it. What's this guy's name right here? Is he Thanos? I think he is Thanos, right? Young master, my lady. Come, my lady. Come, come, my lady. Bro, look at this. Look, somebody come look at this. Who decided that this was the most effective? Like, realistically, how much vibration is that inside of the cockpit right here? And how are we getting these blades to move this fast? Obviously, it's a world that I got to buy into, right? It's a fantasy. You either buy into it or you don't. But, like, how? How sway? Listen, Al Qaib. Voice from the outer world. It's their name for Messiah. These people have waited for centuries for the Lizan Al Qaib. They see you, they see the signs. I saw the sign. Bro, 
shooting through the moving fucking wings. This is pause, but this is just the VFX department. They're just like putting their dick on the table and being like, check this shit out. How much stress are those wings under she from moving that fast? Vibration from the weather and the worms. And the worms, bro, I'm telling you, the worms are like in SpongeBob. We can't refine spice and ship it off world. We're dead here. I know that you have a weapon concealed in your bodies. The weapon is meant as a gift if you are truly the one. Not me, my son is though. She made out of bone? When you have lived with prophecy for so long, the moment of revelation is a shock. The largest and most dangerous organism on Arrakis is the sandworm, capable of reaching 400 meters in length. That is a big ass worm. Insect? What are they? Dog. That looks like that shit from the Matrix 2 that they took out of Neo's stomach. The VFX team did not have to flex on this this fucking hard, bro. They're like, no, no, no. We're going to make sure you know. We're going to make sure you know that this isn't just a projection. We're going to make sure you know that this is a hologram. He's going to walk through it. Dog <laughs> got him. Seeker. The operator must be nearby. Sai, I failed you today. There's no excuse. You have my resignation. You would deprive us of your talents at this time. Sai, I'm an honor to They tried to take the life of my son! You want absolution? Go catch some spies. The Death Star? The thing must leave. Yeah, it might. What the fuck is this? There's gotta be Spider Man in, another, in a different multiverse. Spider with hands. Hands for feet. I mean, I guess. Activate silence. Bro, the cone of silence is so insane. We can't even hear through it. It must never be known. There's no satellite, so Rarakis. Not only is it muffled on the outside, but the sound design team and the sound engineers made it sound like the echo is much closer now because now, they, now they're in this cone, which is smaller than the room. So the reverb is like bouncing quickly back at us. That is insane, bro. But his wife is under our protection and by extension, her son. We will not harm them. This guy's ugly as fuck. I said I would not harm them and I shall not. And the desert takes the weak. Sheesh. Spitting. He's a little ahead on the heavy side for that lifting, for that, for that effect. For four weeks, I lived with the Fremen, hidden in the desert in a community called the Siege. How was it hidden? It's underground. The Fremen watched me search for them for days. I never saw them. Your leader has a knife. He won't surrender, sire. Let him pass. Hold. Thank you, Stilgar. Gift of your body's moisture. <laughs> we accept it in the spirit in which it was given. <laughs> I mean, I guess if we're on a desert planet... Giving up any of the moisture that's available within yourself, including saliva, is seen as like a sacrifice. I mean, I guess it makes sense, but those fighting words where I'm from. The desert was ours long before you came. So come and dig your spice. But when you have it, go back to this side of the shield wall. Your sieges will be yours forever, and you will never be hunted while I govern here. She, she. Ah, shit. Everybody knows him as the one, dog. As Jesus in the flesh. Shout out blasphemy. Is that a deployable hot air balloon? What the fuck? Thank you for the still suits. They are Fremen make. With your permission, sire, I must check the integrity of your suit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm right. down, bitch. Put your knife away. Let's not get crazy. It cools the body and recycles the water, lust to sweat. Worn a still suit before. No, this is my first time. Your desert boots are fitted slip fashion at the ankles. Who taught you to do that? Seemed the right way. He shall know your ways as though born to him, bro. This motherfucker's the one. He's him. That's all there is to it. He didn't even gotta be told. He don't he don't gotta learn. It's just all instinct from within. What would you do if your ornithopter went down out here? You wouldn't want to go down out there. It's worm territory. These worms mean business, bitch. That's club. Bro. If you get a little higher, you'll have a better view. So the sand is the spice? 
or the spice is within the sand and that's what that oh that thing's filtering out the sand right to pull the spice you see these spotter aircraft looking for worm sign worms travel deep but get closer to the surface when they attack worm always comes always always dog noises is that a worm sure is it looks like tremors Big four worm. baby worm sign north and east of you 3.7 kilometers what happens now? Gotta get the fuck They'll out. That's what happens now. Lift the crawler. They'll harvest right up to the last minute. Oh, that's that shit. That that's the one. That's the air balloon, right? Or the hot air balloon that took him up. Anybody? Oh, of course, dog. Of course, some shit goes wrong whenever we're watching a mining for the first time, and we got a worm fucking coming every time. How many men on that crawler? Crew of twenty-one. Our ships can take six each and still three short. We'll find a way. We'll make do, baby. <laughs> hey, yo, that was fucking tight. See, now the movement of the dragonfly makes a lot of sense because you can't just free fall like that with a fucking, with a helicopter. There it is. There's the spices. The spices are the glitter. Wait, so are we going to have to leave this shit here? So we're going to be down to mining drone thing? Droid? Machine? It's getting close, guys. We better abandon ship now. Besides, we're going to fall out of spice. We can't just leave Damn it. the spice! I want every man off that crawler now! Like a true leader, baby. Fuck the spice. I need 21 souls with me in this ship alive. Didn't put his mask on in time. Oh, figured the fuck out. Bro, the shockwave as it breaks through the surface and cracks the surface tension is so insane. Hey, when you were a kid, sand, quicksand, you thought it was going to be way worse of a headache than what it actually is in real life. You were like, damn, I'm going to run into quicksand every other day. Go, 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 get up, get up, get up. Bless the coming and going of him. May his passage cleanse the world and keep the world for his people. Hey, yo, that scene right there had to have won him the whole award on its own. I'm sure there's some dope shit coming up just because, you know, that can't be the climactic scene halfway in the movie. And no one on the conceptual art department was like, hey, the worm's mouth kind of looks like an asshole. Can we change that somehow? <laughs> no one thought of that? That shit was crazy. Spice is a psychoactive chemical. What did you see? I'm telling you, bro, we're getting ho we're gonna get hoed by how much she's in this movie. I feel like it. Ta <laughs> shit, my boy getting active in the middle of the dunes. Love to see it. Love that for you, King. She hate that for you, King. Fuck. Someone will hand me a blade. But I don't know who or when or where. I know you're pregnant. Hey yo. Salusa sick sick. How do you expect me to read some foreign language that quick? Salusa Secundus, Imperial Army Planet. All right, one more thing for me to forget. I already forgot the first planet's name. Somebody get homie a Ricola stat. There's something you need to know about Paul. Ever since you brought him before your reverend mother, he hasn't been the same. If anything happens, will you protect our son? With my life. I'm not asking his mother. I'm asking the Bene Gesserit. Mm. Had to change shirts. Dog got me dirty. Have a good night. Good night, Dr. Yue. Oh! Yup. We done had a breach, my boy. Oh! Uh, oh, shit, it doesn't stop it? Yup. Is that the doctor? The doctor's in on this shit. Get everything with guns off the ground. Go. Man, the cinematography is gorgeous. Oh! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> 
Bro, the fucking VFX right here are so insane. What the f- <laughs> This is somebody's imagination right here. Multiple people. Bro. Boom! Boom! You know what's also tight? You know what also helps sell the scene and make it like, this is a dark ass scene. The fact that they're all wearing that like, that shield, it makes it easier to pinpoint where they're getting struck, where they're not like getting, where the shield's not getting pierced with the blue and then the red. So you can kind of like visually keep track of everything that's going on. Super tight way of like using that in order to visually tell the story. Cause otherwise it should be like a dark, murky, muddy mess. Bro, what's happening? Who are these people? Who are you people? Who are you people? Why? It's always some Judas motherfucker, bro. Imagine you betray Jesus and then everybody uses your name to say somebody's fake. That person ended up being an earnest. That would be shitty. I had no choice. Yeah, you did, bitch. Everybody has oh, choice. I have my wife, Mona. Oh, all right. I respect it. Not really. You take her apart like a doll. I'm going to replace your back tooth, this tooth will crash. Breathe out, and you will fill the air with poison. This bro is basically telling them that you're gonna die anyway, but you might as well take out the Baron with this tooth. Fuck you, bro. How about that? Dead. Dead. These motherfuckers are the stormtroopers of hand-to-hand -hand combat, bro. They didn't even put up a fight. This is the best part of the whole movie, this fucking dragonfly. Oh! I don't know why that made my skin crawl right there. Y'all ever seen that frog when it has its babies, it has them like on her back? The tadpoles like pop out of her back and it ends up just being like a, a lot of holes. Ugh, it's so unnerving, bro. That's, that's how I felt right there. I wasn't like the little tadpoles coming out. He tried to do the voice and she was like, you ain't ready. You ain't built like that yet. The pubes haven't come out. Your balls haven't dropped. Do it again. Do it again. Now or never. This is you. What does the voice do? Is it mind control? That's free food right there for the worms. Set us free. Your pitch was too forced. Mom, not the time for critiquing, bitch. I just saved both of us. They've crippled the ship. Oh, that's no good. Oh man, I know they're tired after this scene right here. I would have passed out at the top of that sand dune. I was about to say, what's it called? Dune. Is he still paralyzed? Deliver my wife from her agony. He's not gonna do it, right? Yes. I forgot this motherfucker can float. I wonder he's fat. He ain't getting no calories. He ain't doing no walking. I said I'd set her free. That you could join her. So join her. I knew that was gonna fucking happen, bro. Nobody respects a traitor, not even the person that you're trading for. That should be like rule number one. You should know that already. And he set her free from the shackles. He didn't say it was gonna kill her. Everybody's just telling half truths in this bitch. Tonight, the house of a traitor falls, and your bloodline ends forever. <laughs> Oh, the emotions of this movie are crazy. She knows. The Emperor sent us here to die. Yup. Yup. This motherfucker survived? Ain't no way. Ooh, that's so, bro, it's just those little, it's just those little details, you know? Because there's dust particles flying everywhere, so why wouldn't there be gold and spice particles flying everywhere? Turns on the light, you see a glow. Super tight. He's gonna see his dad dead. See, bro, Zendaya's been in this bitch for like 45 seconds. I'm already annoyed at the fact they used her so much in the promo. She has yet to say a line. Oh shit, Power Rangers? Oh shit, it's him! I see a holy war spreading across the universe like unquenchable fire. Fanatical legions worshiping at the shrine of my father's skull! Oh my god! A war in my name! Get off me! 
Oh, you did this to me! Shit! You better Jesuit made me a freak! So where are the worms right now? Aren't they noticing the footsteps and the vibration? Your father. I know. Uh huh. The emperor forbids me from saying anything at all. And yet you risk your life to help us. Who are you to the front? I'm the queen, bitch. What's up? I haven't seen green the whole movie. Not even in the palm trees did I see green. Would you bear witness? Testify that the emperor has moved against us here. You'd make a play for the throne. The emperor feared the Atreides. He brought you here to kill you. Furman, speak of the Lasan al Gaib, the voice from the outer world who will lead them to paradise. That's me, bitch. Superstition. I heard what you said about the suit. I know you walk in two worlds that are known by many names. I've seen your dream. Because I'm him. It's a soft landing, my boy. Yep. Yeah. There's trouble afoot. Zarkar! No! Duncan! Oh, no! Fuck, man! Duncan, no! This is Obi-Wan Kenobi and what's his name all over again with the fucking force field during the Darth Maul, Darth Maul fight. Oh, one down, two down. Fuck you, three down, four down. Get the fuck off me. Alright, he might be overwhelmed, not gonna lie. Dog, you put up the good fight. Have yeah, you gotta choice. go. Get the fuck out. He's dead already. Your life had purpose, my boy. GG's. F's in the chat. The score is so crazy, bro. We went from like this really big, dramatic, it's his final exit. This is his last breath. Now we're going into real quick chat. We're, we're chasing. It's fucking, we're, we're in the back alleys of the, of the whole city. The score don't even give you time to breathe on what just happened. Doesn't even give you time to reflect. It's like, nah, nah, nah. We ain't got reflection time. We got all last time. That storm out there is your best shot. About 5,000 meters, it's mostly dust. Climb into it, stay on top, head south, find the Fremen. It really is a good shape for a ship. This might be the second dopest thing besides X-Wings. See, like, that's just not possible right there. <laughs> Smart. It causes steady vibrations. You can turn the shit this way. Ain't no way you catching a ride on the top of a worm. the water that she needed right much less being stabbed mm -hmm. yup 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 you ain't built like me bro her too fuck man that would be a fucking crazy way to die could you imagine just Sinking into a sand pit that happened to be at the mouth of a 400 foot long worm. Wait, wait, wait. Was it 400 meters or 400 feet? D four football fields? Fox one. Fox two. Bro. <laughs> get up, get up, start climbing, start climbing. Obviously, they make it, right? There's no way they don't. A process that cannot be understood by stopping it. We must move with the flow of the process. Bars. We must join it. We Which she did. It. That's a hell of a transition right there between the chaos and serenity. Nothing survives such a storm. They're dead. Every time in a movie when a motherfucker has a line like that, they're always wrong. Unless you saw it with your own eyes, it's never certainty. I know they're dizzy as fuck in there. We're just gonna coast it out. Whoa. That's no good. <laughs> there ain't no fucking way they survived that. Head first into a sand dune. It's like if John Wick just did 50 rollovers in a car and he just gets out scot-free and starts sprinting. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little hot out there, dog. 
Gotta start putting your suits on. Don't watch your son fucking creep. Bro, that is so crazy. What up, my boys? Again, I hate the fact Zendaya's in this bitch because she hasn't said anything. She better be heavy in part two. I will show you the ways of the desert. Can you show me the way? Looks like a Windows loading screen. I can say green or you have That means Fremen live there. We're about to enter worm territory. We can't walk like regular humans. Yeah, that's not great. Run! Damn! You're not gonna outrun this worm. Y'all better get scooped the fuck up by somebody. You win this time, puny ass human. <laughs> I just know that motherfucker's breath smells. <laughs> I was like, how big of a splash is this gonna make trying to get back Whoa. under the sand? How big are they? That was insane. <sighs> Little incesty. Cut it out, Ma. Do not run. Obviously, you bitch. Will only waste your body's water. This is the boy I told you about. We can't touch him. There was a brave crossing they made in the path of Shai Hulud. My thumper saved his life. He's not the one. Your thumper didn't do shit. Let's fucking get it. Yup, yup, yup. Underestimate me again, bitch. Bro pulled out the noisy cricket, bro. I would not have let you hurt my friends. Finally, she fucking speaks. Bro, there is literally only 15 minutes left in this movie. They say you're the Mahdi, but you look like a little boy. Well, fuck you too. Way up. I will not have them. You give a fuck. You may not challenge a Sayadina. Then who will fight in her name? Jamis, don't do this. Where is her champion? I accept her champion. Let's get after it. You just put your own death wish down, bro. He's going to defeat him and then let him live still. Oh, he saw this happen when he had the shit in the dream. Forgot about that. Now he knows how to avoid it. Hey, how bad do these clothes smell? Like for real. No showers? Been sweating all day? Doubt there's deodorant. I don't believe you're the Lisa Al Gahib, but I want you to die with honor. I don't give a fuck. You've had three lines in this whole movie, bitch. Sit down. He did say, I'm going to get a Chris knife. I don't know when, I don't know why, and I don't know from who. Here we are. This deserves $20 million a movie, supposedly. How much she make for this movie? Had to be at least eight. Where's the Outworlder? Shut up. I'm right here. You see me, bitch. What are you talking about? Let's get it, bitch. May thy knife chip and shatter. Let's just get after it, bitch. I ain't got time for all the this semantics. Will kill you. Quicker this way. Whatever you got to tell yourself, bitch. Yeah, yeah. Do you? Oh, oh. Oh. She, the boy doesn't know our rule. Ah! There's no yielding under the Amtal rule. Only death is the test of it. Ah! Then he fucked up by choosing me, bitch. Let's get it. That's twice. That's three times. You're toying with him. I'm giving you a chance, bitch. Oh, the blood's on his hand. Yup. I tried to tell you, bitch, I'm him. Are you not entertained? You saw I gave him a chance. Even though I don't know your rules, I still didn't want him to die. Now what the fuck you gotta say about his Zendaya? Nothing, because you're only allowed five lines in the whole movie. You done already used them. See you in the next one. Yeah, he's the one. That's Neo right there in the Matrix. And that's Trinity right there. Paul needs to get off world. You must have ways. You have smugglers. You have ships. No. You have the Emperor sent us to this place. My father came for the strength of your people. My road leads into the desert. Yup. Yeah, I'm fighting with y'all. If you'll have us. Oh, we will. You just killed my home. You just killed my homeboy. Damn, not the Field of Dreams line. Hey, if you build it, we will come.
Yeah, the score is absolutely fire, bro. Visual effects fire. Zendaya, I swear to God, if you're not in the movie for the next one, at least an hour, I'm going to be pissed. Gas, bro. I don't know why I waited to watch it. I think it's because I knew it was kind of a long movie. I mean, two hours and 35, is that long for a drama? At least of this type of like epic proportion? I guess not, right? It's a good setup movie. It's a good movie on its own, but I'm most impressed with like the actual technical ability to shoot this movie. Like with the visual effects, the score, at the end, like all of that. That is what I'm here for because this is kind of like a build up movie. We got action, but it was more about the growth of him as a coming into his own type shit. I'm ready. I'm ready for the second one. I gotta wait till I gotta wait till it's out of theaters, right? To watch it with you. Oh, fuck. Reactor's Dilemma. I hate it every time. Like the video if you like it. Thumbs up if you did. Comment. Leave, leave me a comment. Do something. Interact and also join Patreon. Catch y'all on the next one.